Ever want to take a random trip somewhere? A trip out of the blue just for the weekend? Somewhere far away where you don't tell anyone and just go? I asked my friend Jess, who lives in Edmonton, if she wanted to come to Chicago and fly somewhere. She responded, Dude, you win the award for craziest email. We looked for the cheapest possible flight to Europe and booked it. We had a connecting flight in Philly, but we were bound for Brussels. Since there's not much in Brussels, we eyed north to Amsterdam. However, there was a problem. Our flight from Chicago to Philly was delayed, and there was no way we were going to catch our connection. We either had to find another way to Europe, or we'd lose an entire day of our weekend getaway. We were effed. I got on the phone with the airline and started to travel hack. What are we doing, fam? We're trying to get somehow miraculously to Amsterdam because our first flight's delayed and we won't catch our second flight. And so we're trying to get a flight to Europe. How are you doing? How are you feeling, Jess? I'll, I'll be better in a minute. So you're not, you're not anxious? You're not, uh... Well, oh, I'm very anxious. You're very anxious? But it'll all work out. Everything works out fine. You look pretty calm. I don't know why. Okay, maybe not that <laughs> When face. things go wrong, the only thing you can do is laugh. Over an hour later, we got a direct flight to Europe and would arrive four hours ahead of schedule. We were in luck, and just as we were ready to board, we were told that we couldn't. Our bags were checked to Philly, and according to the gate attendants, if our bags didn't fly with us, we couldn't get on the plane, because it was an international security issue. So we did what any sane travelers would do. We said F our bags, and we would go the whole weekend abroad with only the clothes in our bags, and pick up our bags on a return trip to Philly. And so we were the last to board the plane, and off we were to Europe until the plane sprang a leak and had to return the gate. We're delayed again. But the universe may be trying to tell us something. <laughs> that I should not turn old? <laughs> That's it, yeah. No turning old. <laughs> On the plane, at least. The plane's not going here. The plane's not going here, right now. Progress. I may have forgotten to tell Jess that when I travel abroad, things go wrong. Really wrong. A short time later, the leak was fixed and we were airborne. Nine hours later, we landed and that's how we ended up in Dusseldorf, Germany. We made it to Europe. Progress. <laughs> yes, huge progress. Two train tickets and then a few hours later, we were in Amsterdam. <laughs> and now, a little fun in Amsterdam. Let's go get a drink. Okay. I wonder if they're used to people just showing up. Just make sure you don't take any pictures of the windows of the bug out there. That's why I'm going sh pointing straight ahead. <laughs> and that's probably the only thing I could use too. <laughs> I, don't, I don't smell anything. No. Just? No, I'm good. It's all you, John. Amsterdam was a lot of fun, but remember our luggage? Yeah, it's not in Chicago. It was last seen in Philly, and it's currently in limbo. Ten bucks says they're in Brussels. Good thing that's where we're headed next.
I wonder how often they had to change his pee. We got our bags and made the best of our time in Brussels. We were actually very impressed with the town, but what was more impressive was everything that we went through. But nothing beats topping off a weekend getaway that became quite the adventure, like a few pints. That is until our hostel found out we were YouTubers and proceeded to watch our videos. So I'm fan fans. That's for art or for money. Just being ridiculous. This is actually no, to see to see who is hotter. Oh, you're actually going to hunt? I use <laughs> Of the many things that went wrong, I will never forget this trip. Like Jess said before we left Chicago, when things go wrong, the only thing you can do is laugh. And we did. Until we got massively delayed on the flight home. Oops. Yes, John. <laughs> <laughs> You gotta admit, I didn't promise an adventure. <laughs>